Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to another, um, I don't know, like sort of midday stream. <laughs> we run out the uh, whatever. Another late night here on the East Coast. Uh, we're just gonna call it late night because it makes it easy. That's what we do. Um, I kind of want to start unlocking everything on hard mode. It's kind of cool. We've been working on it a little bit, you know. We got Samson here. We did pretty good. Azazel crushed it. Nice. Um, I kind of remember Apollyon being garbage. Um, his ability is kind of weird, but I thought maybe you would give him a shot, because I haven't really taken him anywhere past um, Isaac or uh, Shaitan. So why not? Um, Apollyon's ability, you start. Oh, Crystal Labyrinth, and starting right next to two item rooms is kind of cool. Um, but his, his active ability that he starts is called the Void, and if I remember correctly, it sucks up items in a room. Um, like, like item items, like the quarter here could eat that. And okay, it's pretty nice. I mean, I like starting with the quarter. I think that's fun. Um, but the tears up and knockback tears, sure, yeah. But sort of the the fun thing about it is, um, piss is if you use it in a room with an active item, like something like um, the Bible or whatever, it eats that effect. So from now on, whenever he uses the Void, it will uh, use the Bible's effect. Uh, on top of, of course, using the Void effect. Okay, I didn't know that spawned extra guys. That's fine, I guess. Which is kind of interesting. Um, so what that lets you do is eat up a whole bunch of active items, and then throughout the run, like, repeatedly use them. Um, like, it, it, it kind of makes finding multiple active items, which you often do, uh, better. Uh, it's kind of, it's interesting. I, I wouldn't say it's, like, super, super strong, but it's interesting. Um, the other fun effect it has is if you eat a passive item, like something that will give you a stat up, like Pisces there, the quarter. It gives you two random stat ups. I think it's two. It could just be one. I'm sure I remember being two. Um, so, and that's kind of interesting, because sometimes you find, like, you know, an item that you're like, eh, it's not really good. Uh, and it's me, I usually end up taking every item anyway, uh, except for magnetic tears. Because uh, I find that to be, like, <laughs> that more than anything can end your run, let me tell you. Um, but, so it's, it's kind of neat. Okay, nice, we did squeeze in there. A little sketchy for a second, not gonna lie. Um, so it's kind of cool, it can turn bad items into potentially better items, but probably about the same. Um, so it's neat. Oh shit, sorry. Itching my nose there. Forgot he was a regenerating guy. Strength is really good. Going into our, our boss room anyway. It's excellent. And keys are good. Uh, we would have liked to have a bomb because we did find a. Uh, I forget what they're called, the Soul Rock or whatever. On one anyway. But keys cool. We'll probably visit the shop. Um, just because we do have 25, you know, coins potentially get something good on floor one, which would be nice. In worst case, if there's something on sale, we can buy a shit item and then eat it and turn it into a little bit of a stat up, which is kind of nice. Uh, actually getting a lot of keys, which is pretty funky fresh. We like that. I'm just doing a stream now because it's been really hard for me with my schedule to do uh, later streams. Nice. Um, I probably also want that. And um, I've been like super stressed lately, so I tend to fall asleep a little earlier, which is unfortunate. Um, it's what it is. But, um, I thought, you know, I got an hour and a bit before I have to head out, so why not? Hmm. I think we just buy this. I'm not crazy in love with any of those other things. Might have been smart to buy a bomb, but we're going to be going to another shop anyway. 
So here we go. Hello? Oh, we're not going to use the strength on Loki. He's not that bad. He's pretty chill. Or, no, this isn't Loki, right? Uh, Loki's the red one. He's... I don't know. <laughs> the, little, the little black devil. He's cute, though. Uh, he can also very... Yep, I was going to say, he can kill himself with bombs. So, plus one health up? We could do. That's not bad. Um, sure. Probably going to get a devil deal. So. Actually, wait. Can you use strength to be cheeky with devil deals? No, because when you leave, I think you lose that health again. Yeah. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. I've never thought about that. But you could probably use strength if you had zero hearts to gain one heart for a devil deal. I just don't know what the uh, what happens after that. Although we're probably going to be taking this room realistically. Plus one soul heart. Now we're just going to pop that right now. Okay, we'll take the strength with us. So Polydactyl, you can carry two cards, runes, or pills, and drops a random card, pill, or rune on pickup. Um, nope. So we're just going to eat that. And we got um, a little bit of movement speed and a little bit of fire rate. Yeah, Razor Blade's not, not actually good. Um, there's something to be said for buying it so that we lock in Devil Deals. But... Not gonna happen. <laughs> so, no sir. Oh, fuck. I forget what this enemy's called. It's not the knight. The knight's the other annoying one that you can only shoot from behind. That was unfortunate, but that's what it is. So so far, we have a bunch of money. Money's nice. We don't really have anything that I consider like, you know, I mean, like I'm not excited. Yeah. You know? oh, that was unfortunate as well. I'm not looking at this and going, ooh. We got a winning combo here. It's funny, I feel like I could beat Isaac with what I have now. Uh, probably not the blue baby. I don't think I take random worm. Um, but I don't think I could take, you know, sort of everything leading up to type of deal. Also, it looks like since we haven't really got any like crazy items, we're not going to be doing our boss rush. Um, of course, if we wanted to do boss rush, we wouldn't be doing the arena here, so that was a choice I made. But I just felt like we kind of needed a little something. Um... Okay, shit. I never know which way that guy's going. It's, you think he can only charge straight, but he bugs out as he gets knocked around and starts ending up going on weird angles. It's okay. Kind of nice we'll cha charge our item up a bit, though. So we might have to eat something to find an item room. Spiral tears can legitimately be good. It usually isn't, uh, but it can be. If we found, like, an item. Wheel of Fortune's fun. Unfortunately, I went for the uh, the wrong spawner. I went for the one that uh, like died right away. You never know, though. These bats are just a pain in the ass to deal with. Not quite as bad as the little bats. I think those are worse. They just have so much fucking health. And right now we have just like base damage, which is not good. Usually if like you're getting excited about boss rush and things like that, you want to be... You 
you know, having some some exciting damage. Something you can write home about. The knockback on our tears is really nice for like enemies like this. Um, kind of cool, cool thing. Obviously, it's better to just kill enemies in half a second, but. Okay, we're not doing the sacrifice room in this run. Actually, uh, yeah, we're kinda, oh shit. I actually like barely even touched that guy. It's kind of unfortunate. It is what it is. Yeah, that's also unfortunate. You don't really know what's gonna come out of those until like, it comes out, so. Sometimes you get a little bit screwed. Yeah, a lot of keys. Mr. Me is actually super fun. I, I love Mr. Me as an item. Um, but we don't actually need it this run. Wow, really? The item room's down there? Okay. Okay, and the nice thing is if we get something we want to munch in the item room, uh, there's a battery that we can pick up here if we want. I forget if the Bible kills uh, Mum or just Mum's heart. I think it kills her as well. So just because we are like running really slow, that might be a worthwhile pickup. Save us a lot of damage overall. Curse room is kind of interesting. Getting some really weird, like, fucking floors, too. Like, what are these? Why are there a thousand keys this run? Um, what makes chests spawn more often? Guppy's tail. That'd be kind of amazing, actually. Hey, how you doing, Rudy? Yeah, it's just because I got like a million things to do lately, so. I figured get this done now. I'm hoping to stream later as well, but you know, always hard to say. I'm not sure what that champion variant does. Like, it explodes and then does the blood burst. Yep, okay. Oh my god. And some greed heads, which is not, not really what I want right now. My zero damage. Like, we, we have a really, like, weird run going. Kind of nothing has gone the way you would like it to go. <laughs> it's very odd. Okay, Loki's Horns is pretty cool. I'm actually not even sure I consider it, like, an amazing item, but it's fun. And I like fun. It could be good, eventually, later. Or a couple items that make Loki's horns pretty good. Oof, almost got pushed into him. How are you doing, Rudy? How is, uh, work? Are you back to normal? Because we're pretty much back to normal right now. I think they just gave up. <laughs> I know, yeah, it's like 345, what the fuck? Oh, you've been on vacation? Nice, dude. Pro strats. Mm. 
not a gr I was gonna say, this is a very bad fight for us, actually. We just can't kill. I think this is a restart, to be honest. Normally I'm pretty chill about uh, this kind of stuff, but we just... We just don't have any damage. We can't kill any of the adds. In a fight like that. Fortunately. Oh, the fuck? This is another weird run. The very weird basement one. Oh, that's nice though. You always want to see deck of cards. Actually, if I was more clever, I would have. Oh no, because it, it did use it after I ate it. Oh, cool. Okay, I see the rock. I cannot interact with the rock. Deck of Cards is really fun, though. But I think I should have used Deck of Cards first, and then ate it. I feel like that would have interacted interesting with the game. Hello, Dangus. Is this the charging one? Oh, it's red poop. Okay, well that's not good. He still charges you. Cool. Oh, and he charges four times instead of three? Oh, and he does one damage. That's pretty crazy cool. You're an XCOM 2 in a time limit. I actually just hate those about XCOM 2. Fuck. Time limited missions are just not enjoyable in my opinion. Pauline's such a weird character. There's just like, kind of nothing good about him. Like his active item's okay. He's kind of like shit Judas, I guess. This Judas actually has like a, when firing, get a green ore that poisons enemies. I'm pretty sure this is scary. I should have ate that. I'm just gonna restart right now. I'm just gonna do it. Fuck, cause that item is so bad. And I was like, I was just saying, Apollyon's fucking garbage. And then I'm like, oh yeah, I could've ate that item. Made it actually good. That's my bad. I just wanna get one run in before I have to go to work. And uh, gotta, I already bought some stuff. I just have to pick up like a bunch of wood basically. I've got a project around the house to do. Like a million of those, cause you know, Caitlyn's been home, so he's been like, oh, we should do this and this and this. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I would like to. Uh, Explosivo is pretty fun. I find you usually end up killing yourself with Explosivo. Yeah, he's, he's definitely, he's interesting. Yeah, I'll give you that. I don't think there's anything, like, um, good about him, though. Like, most of the other characters, except, like, I guess the Lost. I don't I'm the lost, but you know, most of the other characters at least like they bring something to the table. Um, and his is a lot more like reliant on you getting certain items to appear. <laughs> yeah, well, the lost is meant to be a challenge character. I don't, I don't mind that because like you know he's put in with that purpose, right? Nice. I like getting keys and a bomb and... Oh shit. I was... Oh no. I was gonna say, there's no way I'm avoiding damage here. <laughs> well, that's fair, Rudy. I think I'm pretty good at this game. I'm definitely, like, not the best. But I feel like I, you know, probably put me like... Oh shit. I was gonna say, that guy's gonna trick me in a sec. I put myself like top 20%? I think that's probably reasonable. It's just this this character is really rough. Any character with just like baseline speed, shit all damage. It's a tough sell. It's a tough sell. It's like Maggie. I absolutely hate playing Maggie. Um I think 
Polyan's probably worse than Maggie though, because Maggie can game like arcades. Which you don't get anywhere near as much as you used to. Um, old Isaac, like you would get arcades like all the goddamn time. Here it's pretty rare. Little Horn, that's his name. I'm not sure what this variant does. It throws more troll bombs, maybe? Well, anyway. Jesus juice, damn. Like that. There we go. We, we got our damage up. That's all we need. We're definitely going to check the shop out. Say hi. What you got? Battery and... Spacebar items can be charged up twice. It's pretty... Pretty cool, actually. I think we'll uh, go for a little bit of that. Yeah, that that's the problem with Maggie. It's like, like you said, she she adds nothing. Okay, fuck. She adds nothing except she has like more healing. But I mean, it's like one of those weird things because like you actually don't want to heal in this game. I mean, you do. It's certainly good, but you just rather things die, you know what I mean? Yeah, this is one of those rooms that's very difficult for us. There are no damage. Uh, and like I said, Explosivo, it's like, it's an item you take that you know it's probably going to get you killed. Um, until you have movement speed, you can't get away from your own bombs, so. End up in a bad place. Book of Secrets is fun. Just gonna munch that though. Let's see what we got. Lost contact. Shielded tears. Tears block enemy shots. That's kind of a. It's kind of a weird item. Um. So shielded tears sound really good, because it's like, oh cool, like, I'm not going to get hit by enemies now. But what it ends up being, unfortunately, is, um, fuck base speed, it's so, so hard to play around. Like, if you're not at, like, at least 1.2, you're having a bad day. Um... Oh, well, that's kind of fun, it's a little Satan rim or something. Like that. I forgot what I was saying. Base speed is just, ugh. It's not good though. Yeah, hopefully I'm gonna be building some uh, raised uh, garden beds. Ah! Today. That'll be fun. Nice, a little library. That'd actually be really good for Polygon. If we had, um, you know, a way to get in there. <laughs> we could. We could definitely get a key. Uh, we really want flight as well, so hopefully the Bible's in that. All's a seal. Nice. And we don't know that is a library. It could be a, um, like a dice room, uh, which would be kind of cool as well. We're probably not getting a devil deal, unfortunately, this floor, but that's fine. Can't get too upset about something like that. I mean, I, I made some misplays and got hit. That's what it is. Light blue and white, yep. Uh, it doesn't matter though, because uh, the game now keeps track of them for you. It didn't used to, but it does now. Hmm. I think we're okay. We could always reroll though. You know? It's kind of fun. Oh, we don't know what that pill is. Okay, that's too bad. And what do we got in here? So again, flight would have been really nice. Um, I mean, ah, oh shit. Yeah, this is gonna be rough. I was gonna say. Health up? Yeah, I think we do take it. Sadly, we didn't get our, our devil deal, and we're not getting flight, so we can't get 
the shielded tears. So what we're going to do is we're just going to eat it. Because I don't have a way of getting it. So. Well, at least get a stat up. Oh yeah, the problem with shielded tears is when you eat it... Hey, speed up. Nice. Okay, that helps a lot. Um, your tears like die when they block something. So unless you have a lot of fire rate, um, in some fights you actually cannot hit anything because your tears die faster than they come out. Oh, that was kind of rude. I can't blame him for it. We'd probably like a luck up or something. Uh, and then like another cool tear effect. Um, or just some speed would be nice as well. Uh, definitely flight. Flight is always something... Oh, hello. And I don't think we're doing Mega Satan. Because we kind of have nothing right now. But uh, I'm, I'm not above going... You know, you know me. I, I like to go to the sacrifice rooms and gamble all my health, so we might be able to do a Mega Satan. That's fun. Yeah, this is just a case of our character doesn't have uh, mobility at the moment, so. A little difficult to deal with. What you got? Oh yeah, we don't have a key. It's awkward. We're gonna have a real hard time getting back here too, uh, because Curse of the Maze is on. Curse of the Maze likes to just screw you completely. It's like, sorry, are you trying to go back to that room? No. No, it's not happening. You're just gonna teleport around for 10 years. Nice. Worked out. Okay, and he's dead too. Nice. That is the fun thing about Explosivo, though. Is like, sometimes you peg an enemy and you're like, yeah, you're dead now. The problem is that enemy is going to try and get up to you and then you die. Especially when you hit like something like the spiders, because they're really fast. And then it just explodes and kills you. Like, just one key, please. Just one. Not asking for a lot. But yeah, I remember the old Isaac, like, always having to remember, like, oh, okay, uh, this run, red and blue is this. Oh, no, it was red, but, like, sideways red and blue? And Yeah, that was always good times. Hey, Foxy, how you doing? That was just rude. I don't know why he randomly shot it that way. It's okay. Well, if we had flight, which we don't, we could get a key. Like I said, we don't, so, you know, kind of SOL. Oh god, there is a lot of things going around. Explosions on them. You feel like crap? That's not nice. E. Um. I guess we probably do this fight now, because we have half a heart. And we would love to get us a devil deal. Really nice. Oh, hello. Nice. Drops a random trinket on pickup and an extra trinket slot. No. Um, these also suck. Ugh. Uh, yeah, I don't think I take either of these, even though I really like getting Guppy. We're kind of late to, like, conceivably see Guppy, right? Yeah, we'll take it. That's fine. Guppy's hairball's definitely not good, but... Whatever. Oh, this is a fucking room, too. Jesus. It's never too late for Guppy. I mean, it kind of is. You can 
you you definitely get a feel for not seeing Guffy at some point in a run. Oh, that's cool. It tells you how long I've been streaming it. That's nice. Yeah, I would love that justice right there. But... Also love the band justice. Kind of nice. Oh god, explosive! Oh fuck off! It's getting real sketchy. Oh, it's freeze all enemy in the room until you press the button again. Hmm. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. Um. Oh, yeah, I forgot we had the book of secrets, didn't we? What was this run? I think we ate it. That's interesting. Hey, nice, we got a lock up. Nice. Everything's coming up Millhouse. Not, not there. Okay, not here either. Fox Coffee's not censored. What are you doing, you goof? Um, we need keys, so I think I'm gonna check this out. Oh, could be Guppy. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I, I break this game pretty much, um, I'd say like 75% of the time I can break this game. All depends on the character too, right? Like some characters are really easy to break the game with. Some characters are just baseline good. Um, of course, Polyon not being one of them. Like the the last two Isaac runs I did, um, you know, I broke the game with Samson. Broke the game with um, what was it? Um, so, no, it wasn't Judas. Hmm. I hate these enemies. Fuck off. Anything that makes me wait, I actually get so angry. I don't want to sit around, especially when I'm trying to, like, speedrun and shit. Oh, Azazel. But Azazel's really easy to beat the game with, so... Oh my god. Could we not? Doesn't help that Explosivo, like, kind of fucks us up. Come on. Like, okay. When coin, key, and bomb counter equal, it turns out oh, whatever. You take equality even though it sucks because. Uh, yeah. That's what it is. It, like, equality never works until it does. You know, and that, that kind of makes sense, I guess, but... What the fuck is this room? Jesus, no. Okay, now we got problems, because there's fucking bombs everywhere. Everything's fine. That's the other thing, too. Until we get flight, like, Explosivo is just gonna murder us constantly. Without mercy. Larry J with a bomb on him. And we're definitely curious. What's in the box? Another box and nothing. Are you? Oh shit! Oh shit! And are you a wizard? Is um, well, it's a pill. It lasts fucking ages. As well. Do not recommend picking it up. Not even as a joke. There's actually a um, an item that gives you the permanent Are You a Wizard effect, I believe. Which is just... Just madness. 
Of course, when, when you pick it up, you don't know it's going to be what it is, right? Uh, I think we kill the poops, because we need kind of a handout right now. Something cool. Dunce hat. Yeah, that's the one. Fuck that. Um, so we want our curse room. We also really want a devil deal. Which seems unlikely at this point, but... You know, stranger things have happened. Arcade. Oh, a key beggar, which we don't have things for. Um, this is nice though, because you can rest there to heal up. But certainly not what I want from an arcade. Oh fuck, this room is also going to be rough. Oh no, never mind. I got really lucky with Explosivo. I thought they were going to rush us, as they often do. Still no item room. Not, not amazing. Oof. Oof. Okay. I didn't screw myself there. Oh, it would be greed. A little bastard. Shit. Okay. We should go back for those heals. We should. You've heard me say it. I'm, I'm aware. <laughs> uh, are we? Well, no. Apparently not. Range down? That's fine. Doesn't really affect us right now. So boss rush is officially off the table. Uh, we can just heal here at the arcade. That's fine. Remember, something like if you blow up a bed, or... Remember there used to be a spot you could blow up in the bedrooms and something would happen? I've forgotten. Nice. Oh, the carpet, that's right, yeah. It's been so long since I played this and I just started getting back into it and I'm like... What is everything I remember about Isaac? A lot, but not enough. That's what we're gonna say. That was nice. Okay, and he's dead now. Which is good. Wow, the fuck this floor, though. Oh, power pill, cool. Uh, I guess we do the ball. Oh, the fallen. Uh, early. The only thing I hate about the fallen is I think you can randomly snap rim. And anything that snap rims, I get so mad. Oh yeah, and the two of them can. That's for goddamn. Okay. Well, there goes our devil deal. Just fine. Uh, I don't think that hit me. I'll be honest with you. Like I, I'm fine with admitting that, like I get hit by stuff, but I don't think that one did. Uh, unless Apollyon's hitbox is larger than his model. That's okay. We didn't really get anything too cool. I mean, Explosive was fun, but... This is just a shitty room. Ragman. Nice. <laughs> It's a bit of a shitty fight for us as well, because the no damage and all that cool stuff. Ah. 
do like his little teeth though. Like, he's a really fun model. Nice. Uh, hello again, Jesus Juice. Kind of weird, but whatever. Isaac's Tears is actually pretty fun, I think. Oh man. I just straight up... How does the Void work with Isaac's Tears? Because I think Isaac's Tears is just straight up better in the Void. Like, by a lot. Because I can tear burst that fast? Like, that seems insane. Doesn't say. I think this is what we end up taking. It sucks, because it's like when you play um, Judas, right? Um... When you play Judas and it's like you find a good active item and you're like, well this sucks that I have to replace um, my item. say if it works with it. I assume it doesn't. That'd be cool. Okay, well, goodbye the void. It was nice knowing you. It's like rip, you know? This is like super fun. Uh, we're definitely gonna want a key. Do we check out the curse room and probably die? Hell yeah. Oh, well, now we do. Anyway. If we get any cool tier effects, this is gonna be like especially nice. Oh. I mean, Yara lets you break the game pretty good. Assuming items spawn, assuming you get an arcade, assuming a lot of things. We're not going to get an arcade, though, because we don't have three coins. That's probably the best thing about Judas, actually, is starting with three coins. It's pretty strong. rooms go. Not my favorite, <laughs> but not the worst. Definitely seen worse today already. It's kind of nice we had a heart drop. On hard, um, your heart drops are like super reduced. That's like the big change that happens. Not really lucky there, actually. Because champion mobs always deal full hearted damage. 
Which once you, you reach the womb and down, uh, everything feels full fucking heart. Till then. I think it's worth probably breaking these. Just oh, didn't line myself nice. There you go. Got a penny. Need three for the arcade. Holy shit, this is a room. It could have gone much worse. You normally get those enemies like in the middle of like a really small room and you're just kind of SOL. Mom's razor. I don't know if this blocks tears. Uh, we're gonna go back the other way. I think the boss is going forward. Oh, hello, Envy. Might screw us out of the devil deal, taking that hit there. Depends how well I do on the boss. Shoop -de -whoop. Uh, shoop -de -whoop will help me kill the boss, actually. I go with that. Still just base speed, though, my god. Please, video games. I beg of you. Wow, I can't believe I hit the fire there. That is very unfortunate. Just not paying, paying attention, I guess. But it does suck. Is this razor supposed to do damage? Probably not a ton, right? I touched monster and it seemed like it didn't really do anything. Yeah, okay. Oh, that sucks. It's too bad, too, because we got some nice items otherwise. It's just like Judas, like it really sucks when like the one thing you play a character for, like the void in this case, or um, Judas has uh, a book of rev, he has the Necronomicon. It's like, oh yeah, you found something that replaces that immediately. So it's like, well. Like, why did I play this character thing? It's kind of an annoying room. not feeling it. Sometimes you're just not on the group. You play Isaac. Maybe I'm just better when I am tired. Or alert or something. Not 
not sure. Yeah, I'm just making stupid mistakes right now. Uh, maybe I just call it then, because clearly it's not working out. Got a little bit in. I got a bunch of shit to do. But I'll try and be back on tonight and get some stuff in, and then I gotta be up early in the morning, so... We'll see. I'm trying. Anyway, take it easy, folks.